Hello, Tela County and El Paso County. We are seeing inflation continue to go down, but there are still economic indicators that are keeping the Fed from releasing the pressure on interest rates. This has caused some buyers to pause and others to take advantage. For more info about the housing market, be sure to check out my monthly real estate market series, which lets you know what's happening both locally and nationally. But for now, let's take a look at what's happening right here in the Pice Peak region. Hi, I'm James Dean, team leader of the James E. Mount Real Estate team. Let's look at what's happening in Teller County. At the time of this recording, there were 100 active listings, and there was a total of 137 listings in the month of February. There are currently 61 homes that are pending and 22 homes that sold in February. Homes sold for an average of $557,705 and were on the market an average of 60 days. There are many ways to interpret this for, for Teller County. The two most probable ways are number one, is it an anomaly that we have seen over the past two weeks when the weekly average of a total of 75 homes being active at one time was the norm and is this 33% increase only a small bump? Or number two, is this the start of a trend that we will see form over the next couple of months? What is obvious is that the number of sales have come down on a monthly statistic and that because of this uptick and the fact that we have come out of the slowest season for home sales, which is normal for the holiday season, we now look to have over six months of inventory. Now this number is not a number to rely on until we have seen it persist. What I can say is that it is probably the best time we have seen for a buyer to enter the market and get a home under contract in two and a half years. What no one can say is how long this will last, but it is certainly something that needs to be discussed when strategizing on buying or selling a home. In El Paso County, we have 1,218 active homes, and there were a total of 2,365 listings in the month of February. 1,091 are pending, and 845 are sold in the month of February after spending a total of 53 days in the market. Homes in El Paso County sold for an average of $484,233. For the month of February in El Paso County, we have seen, an seen the inventory drop to 2.8 months of inventory. So you can see with the changing market, it is no surprise to us that homes are staying on the market longer, but we have less in the market now than we had for the previous six months. With the constant shifts, you need an experienced agent to help guide you through your next moves in real estate. Connect with my team today to get more information and we can strategize what to do with your home. And again, I'm James Dean. Remember, we are your local mountain real estate experts.